Okay, well, no thickened system, so I need to ro ro reduce to echelon form, and I need to put a zeros in this bottom left hand corner here. So to get row two, I want a zero there, so I'll have row two take away to row one, and I want a zero here, so I'll be row three. So I have to multiply row one by four and subtract it from row three. So that's row three minus four, row one. Okay, so it's 2x minus 2x is nothing. Y take away 4y is minus 3y. 3z take away 4z is minus z. And 3 take away 2 is 1. Row 3, that's 0. 5y take away 8y is minus 3y. 7z minus 8z is minus z. And lambda minus 4. And then to get a zero year, I can have row three is going to become row three minus row two. I'm just subtracting row three and row two to get a net zero entry there. So the first two rows remain the same. And then subtracting them, minus three, minus, minus three, zero. Minus Z, minus, minus Z is zero. And I got lambda minus four, minus one, which is lambda minus five. Now if they're consistent, for the equations to be consistent, then I need naught equals naught in the third line. So I need lambda minus 5 to equal naught. So lambda is equal to 5. And then the second part, I want to find the general solution for this value of lambda. So my equation then are x plus 2y plus 2z is 1. Minus 3y minus z equals 1 and 0 equals 0. Solutions coming from the second line. So I let z equals lambda. Substitute into the second line. That's minus 3y minus lambda is 1. Minus 3y equals 1 plus lambda. So y is 1 plus lambda shared by minus 3. So I put that over 3 minus there. And to find x, go back into the first row. So I'll have x plus 2y. So that's minus 2, lots of 1 plus lambda over 3, plus 2z equals 1. To get rid of the fraction, just multiply every term by 3. So that's 3x minus 2 times 1 plus lambda, plus 6 lambda equals 3. Expand the bracket. We get 3x on its own. Take the minus 2 over, so that gives me 5. Plus 4, that's minus 4 lambda. So x is 5 minus 4 lambda over 3. So there's my three parametric coordinates of the line. So the, the solution is these three parametric coordinates. And that represents the parametric equation of a line in 3D.